The ultimate voyage coming to a city near you is the music of Star Trek. And one of the most prolific, maybe the most prolific writer of Star Trek music is Dennis McCarthy. Dennis. Wow. Pleasure, wow. Pleasure. Thank you. You've written more music than most classical composers. Star Trek was my college, in a sense. My education came from Star Trek. I mean, I had done MacGyver before that and Dynasties and Colby's and all that stuff, which were great. But Star Trek, I was really given reign. I mean, they just said go. What I would do is I'd, I'd watch the scene once, and I'd sit at the piano. As Sierminski said, the piano is the mother of all music, and I would just start to play. So it was instantaneous, simultaneous, no planning, no sketching, nothing. And I'd just start writing it out, or fully orchestrated. I just, I just wow. never went to a sketch. And I'm looking into your eyes, and you were terribly moved by the music you yeah. wrote. This is the kind of music that people in the audience are going to hear at The Ultimate Voyage. Your music put to Star Trek episodes. It's going to be wonderful. So here you are writing music. Sometimes you like it, sometimes you don't like right. it. And you correct it on the run. On the spot. Like, a, like a, a, a writer who says, that paragraph is no good, I'll rewrite the paragraph. Right, right. You rewrite the paragraph musically. Well, what, I can see it in my head, too. I can see right. a score in my head. Really? I've, well, I've been Do you see it. the notes? Yeah. Um, it's kind of weird, but it's, I, can, I can visualize a score, and I, and I make the changes in the score in my head, and I'll just start going to the French horn. To the French horn. And he's good enough to go, did you say, or did you say, Well, the other thing I tell him is that it's what I just sang to you, I'm not going to remember, so you better get it the first time. <laughs> and do they? Yeah. Oh, that's oh, a these, language that none of us speak except these, these guys. These, these guys. You guys. I mean, I just... I, I stand in awe of the musicians. I do too. I do too. Uh, because music, no other entity on earth creates music. They sing. Right, right. Animals sing, but nobody takes a cat gut and a horse hair and makes a sound. Right. Or blows through a tube and, yeah. and something pure comes out. Yeah. We're the only ones who do that. Exactly. There's a magical thing about music that everybody's aware of, but not enough people. Talk about it. Exactly.